Hello people, Seek with Senpai here, and here's Fruits Basket, episode 11. This is a wonderful end. So last episode we had a little background information, well not really a lot of background information, but we got a little bit in depth on the character of Shigure. So, you know, the guy who's usually joking around and stuff, you know, being chill in the background, but you know, not everything is what it appears to be for him. Or so it looks like to be. So, yeah, I look forward to seeing more of that in the future episodes, maybe, maybe this episode. Um, but yeah, here we are. Yeah, let's do this. Oh, so they had exams. Or midterms, probably. Oh. No, that's good. That's good. That's something to look forward to. Remember my SATs? I try my best to answer as much as I can, but also try not mess up. <laughs> okay, so she helped him, or he helped her study. Oh! <laughs> so she's not a good studier. <laughs> uh, see, looks are deceiving. <laughs> uh. Oh, well, she got a hundred percent A plus. Oh, surprising. <laughs> his academics are good, but his he but seems like he's an out there personality. Hmm. Then he also had that weird dream in the beginning of the last episode. I don't think I talked much about that, but... Hmm. Oh, what was that? Hmm. Okay. Yeah, go. Yeah. Oh, I know I'm bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm horrible. Okay. Oh yeah, she works at the building where Momoji's um relative is the CEO or something. Okay, so it's a secret to show to all of them. It's probably the the fact that they have like an inn or something. To like a hot spring? <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't know. 14th of March. White day. Ah! Okay. Okay. Oh, it is a hot spring. Okay. I mean, obviously if it's an inn and it's Japan, what else would it be? Oh, really? So one of the Somos running in. They can they got all their real estate out there, so <laughs> they got like their own town. Dang, she's so happy she's crying. Okay, so it's just the Soma like house thing that they don't like going to. But look what's other things Soma related. Oh That's what that was. Okay, so that's why they bothered her on that. Ah! <laughs> they realized it was the chocolate. <laughs> if you happen to hear any, like, knocking or anything, that's, that's downstairs. Someone's nailing stuff into the wall. To me, I was almost like trying to burst through my wall here. <laughs> she always smiles. She's always being so optimistic. Hmm. That's true. But it's something she wanted to do. <laughs> He's only saying this because he cares. Oh. <laughs> the most idiotic travel in the world. <laughs> ha ha ha. Okay. So that's... <laughs> I didn't even be so obnoxious. <laughs> hmm. Oh, okay. Hmm. 
Dang. Dang. That's met the demons of sorts. Oh boy. Oh man. Gave them everything. Ew. Use a gift in return. What was that? <laughs> she couldn't even read that though. That was messed up. Thank you so much. Ah, oh, that's kind of true. I mean, look at all the things. The traveler gave up everything but didn't get anything in return. She was being so thankful even though it deceived her. But Demon was the only one, the last one that gave her something like that. Back in the end. I mean... That's so stupid, but I mean, the traveler, but I mean, uh, I don't know. They were still happy about something in the end. They would still have some sort of optimism, regardless of how horrible the scenario was. Even though they were a bit, you know, they thought more of their heart rather than their head. I mean, still, they did it because... They are kind enough to do so, even though it was like being deceiving. But they had good intentions with giving them, you know, I'll give you my coat and stuff, you know. Even though it was still like, bad. Oh! Okay. <laughs> they had like a little moment there. No, he was like, dang it. <laughs> it's not me to be her. It's just me and her. <laughs> what does the hot spring look like? Oh. What? Oh, snap. Someone's dying. <laughs> Properist? What? You need some water or something? Your throat's sounding dry. Like, oh, she is frail. I'm I'm sorry about that. She has frail help. That's <laughs> she's like, oh, yeah, this don't get along. <laughs> I got a shower removed. Damn Yuki, not just Yuki, but <laughs> Oh <laughs> the... <laughs> the innkeeper. <laughs> she was over there watching. <laughs> <laughs> So she does know about the Zodiac. But she mentioned the cat. Oh, so Momoji is a guy. I feel like they mentioned that, but I'm like... So who's watching the front? I, I'm sure there are some other people working there. What's wrong with me? Oh, so her child is the Zodiac. That's how she knows. Oh, really? Okay, the monkey Zodiac. Hmm... I don't think the memory racing and stuff. Huh. Glad to see she's alright. Mm. I wonder who the monkey one is. We never know. At least I never know. <laughs> so her child's a little out there. <laughs> they get too serious. <laughs> oh, he doesn't even know how to play. <laughs> well, I just that slows me down. <laughs> he does not. <laughs> oh, man. You couldn't even follow the rules. That sounds fun to watch. <laughs> that actually does. Oh, she's serious, too. <laughs> well, she's just as bad. Oh, no, Jess. Ah, <laughs> uh, have no hand eye coordination. No, <laughs> he got nowhere to talk. <laughs> yeah, dude was swinging it like a baseball. You had to walk outside just to laugh. <laughs> this guy. Hmm. He's so private with his emotions. Oh, okay. <laughs> and you want to do it in private, too. 
braids or wraps or yeah the thing for the hair oh it's that thing like it's for your hair but I mean oh Hey! How was my act? I don't think that was an act. You be having some moments within this episode, man. There's all different types of somas out there. Oh, so she's going to stop working and... Oh! Oh, boy. going to get crazy. Oh, so Haru's going to go to that school, too? <laughs> Surprise, surprise! <laughs> uh, that's great. Oh! What, really? What? <laughs> Same. Or at least I thought he was like in early uh, middle school, but... Ah, uh, boy. You're telling me your school is going to get livelier? About to give him. Oh, so he's gonna move in with them, or, or they're probably just gonna do how they they usually travel, whatever. <laughs> hey, give appreciation to end this thing. Okay, anyways, <laughs> um, that's Hatsuri. That's Momoji. Is that Haru? Yeah, that's Haru. So this episode, we got to see um the end. Um, who's that? We haven't seen these characters yet. The lamb zodiac? Or is it the ram? The ram got the tiger. Wait, so wait, hold up. How's there wait, there is a tiger zodiac, right? <laughs> Someone said, you gotta look up these zodiacs, man. It's been ten episodes. That's eleven episodes now. <laughs> How come you don't know them? Well, wait, so they have the tiger zodiac, but they don't allow the cat zodiac. That that seems weird to me, but whatever. Um excuse me, one feline versus another feline. But then again, there's that story. Okay, next episode, you look like you're having fun. Okay. So anyways, um, yeah, another great episode of Fruits Basket. And we got to see the end. We got to see like a little bit moments with Toru. Man, I'm forgetting names all of a sudden. Um, we had like a little good, a little cute moments, one with Toru and Kyo. They had like a little heart to heart moment, you know, it's like, yeah. And then we had another one with um, Toru and Yuki, which was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. and um, <laughs> Sorry, that, that was a little cute. Um, but yeah, we also learned that Haru and Momoji, well Momoji's a year younger than them. I I actually didn't think that was the case, but that's also a surprise. See, looks can be deceiving. And then yeah, they plan to go to the and they're um registered to go to their school for the next semester coming up because right now it's March for them. And if memory serves me right, semesters in Japan or the next school year um, starts in April. So, hey, April? Yeah, April for the cherry blossoms. So, yeah, springtime. So, yeah, well, they're having testing. So, was that their finals then? That had to be their finals because that would make sense if it was the midterms. Yeah, anyways, yeah, that's all I have to say. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. Correct me if I was wrong about any of that. In my anime knowledge that I have learned about Japan is there, but. Yeah, I look forward to the next episode. Um, looks like you're having fun. Yeah, that's a great episode. I don't know how many edits I will have on this episode because my pizza, I ordered pizza. It's about to be here soon. So, and also I had no video up earlier for Bungo Stray Dogs. I did record something, but unfortunately when it came to, when I was about to edit, it turned out that my screen recorder froze midway. So, um, that caused everything else to like lag out. So, yeah. Yeah, again, that's all I have to say. Thank you guys for watching. Have a, test. Have a fantastic day. We night. you. So, I'm a little tired. I was working really. I, that's why I was out of town. I was picking stuff up, putting things together, bringing stuff outside, bringing stuff inside. And I came home and I was doing that again. And then I was like, oh man, fruit basket air. Story of my life. Thank you guys for watching again. Have a fantastic day. We night the year. And you guys will see me next week for another episode, definitely. And next week I have an episode of Bungle Stray Dogs up. Hopefully, if nothing goes wrong, hopefully this episode's up. Um, well, if I'm talking right now, then it's, it's up. Um, otherwise, I'm just wasting my breath. So. <laughs>
that's all I have to say. Tomorrow, um, what is it, Demon Slayer? I haven't had a video up for that for a couple weeks now, so you have to catch up to that show as well. So. Yeah, that's all I have to say. That, now that's all I have to say. Tangents. Peace.